So in this video revealing how to start a t-shirt business for free and how complete beginners can earn $100 to $700 a day with no experience with their first t-shirt business. More with that after the intro. Hey guys, how's it going? Mike Vasile here. Welcome to this video. Before we actually begin, I remind you that several spots have opened up for this week's free workshop, where it's the fastest and easiest way to make money online. We literally have a 62 year old woman go from zero to 160 grand profit in 90 days, so sign up for it now. So, one of my first business ideas that I ever had was essentially selling t shirts because why? I just thought it was like really cool that you could sell things that you've made with like your designs and your products and whatnot. My only problem was I'm not a designer, I'm not a graphic designer, I, I, I don't understand the creativity and much not because you can see my background backgrounds, biology, chemistry, math, and science, right? But like I just thought it would be really cool to start a t-shirt business and then I faced all of these, for example, like hurdles that prevented me from actually succeeding. Um, but of course I ended up learning a lot from like this type of business. I was able to go from zero to $700 a day selling Jesus t-shirts and elephant t-shirts and I took that skill set and even got into e-commerce in general and we were able to scale from nothing to five grand in 30 days to 1.6 million that first year, right? Uh, but when people get started with t-shirt business and e-commerce and whatnot, they're like, well Mike, that's great for you but I don't have the time. No, I do have the money. And people think in their mind that they need need so much time to go ahead and start a t-shirt business or they think they need money to buy their own inventory. That's what I thought. I'm like, don't most t-shirt companies need a bunch of t-shirts? So don't you have to buy a bunch of t-shirts? And how can I buy a bunch of t-shirts before selling them if I don't have any money? The thing is you don't, okay? There's literally services and softwares that will literally give you an infinite an infinite amount of t-shirts, an infinite amount of inventory. They'll do the shipping, the handling, the customer service for you for free. Now the only thing is learning how to navigate it. But before we actually go into the nitty gritty, you need to understand one thing, and that is people buy t-shirts because it relates to their identity, okay? I've sold t-shirts about Jesus, about uh, like for example elephants, about like dentists, about lawyers, about doctors, about firefighters, about policemen, why? Every single one of those t-shirt designs tie into their identity. Now of course like you can sell t-shirts um, and stuff like with designs that you make, like but that's a little bit more advanced, okay? When you first get started, you need to get what is known as a belief check, and that is your first sale to know that you can actually make money. So that's kind of like the next level, you know, your your like Lululemons, your your like your like Alpha Leads, your other t-shirt businesses that are like huge. In the beginning, you need to first stem with people where this t-shirt design is wrapped around their identity. So how did I know to go for like elephants and Jesus, right? Well, I'm Filipino, super Catholic family. Uh, I just knew if I couldn't sell these t-shirts to anyone online, my aunties and uncles would, 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 would buy them, right? Elephants, I dated this Polish girl in high school. I went and came over once and her grandma had all these elephants. It was kind of like weird, right? She had elephant pillowcases, elephant blankets, elephant statues, elephant t-shirts. I was like, what's the deal with this? And she was like, yeah, you know, like my like grandma thinks elephants are lucky. So in my mind, I understood that, wow, those are huge identities of each other, right? Why do you think a lot of people buy like Jake Paul and Logan Paul's t-shirt designs? Because they have an identity as the Jake Paulers or the low gang, right? People buy what represents their identity. And if you could understand what people's identities are and turn that into a design, it makes it a lot easier before getting into starting a t-shirt business, right? Now the next step, once you actually understand that and identify that, really seriously, identify it, what are all the people that have a very strong identity based around that thing about their identity? I don't know, occupations are big ones, dentists, lawyers, chiropractors, um, fighter fighters, policemen, right, that's a big one. Pets, animals, right, so elephants, dogs, beagles, cats, chinchillas, whatever, hamsters, pugs, uh, bulldogs, that's another one, as well as like creators. Right, so people buy merch from like Casey Neistat, Lo, um, Logan Paul, Jake Paul, a bunch of those creators. Those are kind of like the main things when it comes to identities, right? Now, once you understand that, uh, how are you gonna sell this? Because with a t-shirt business, what do you need? You need inventory, you need sales, you need marketing, right? You need to deliver the product. Those are four things of most online businesses. But there are certain ways that you could start a t-shirt business for free where you don't have to do delivery, you don't have to do sales or marketing, you don't have to do even like creating the product. Someone else would do the shipping, handling, and customer service for free for you. So one of the places you could go is for example Amazon, 
Now Amazon is cool because it's free to start with merch by Amazon. So you're essentially making Jeff Bezos and his minions spend all of their billions of dollars on an infinite amount of t-shirt designs for you for free. And you can see that all you gotta do is upload your designs, um, reaching millions of customers worldwide, set a list price, we print what's sold, fast shipping with Prime, and you earn monthly royalties. Now some of these designs, if you can match it for certain identities, can make you $100 a month in passive income for free. Like I said, when someone buys it from Amazon, Amazon will do the shipping, handling, customer service, and they'll pay you for it, right? So you're probably wondering, well, Mike, how, how do I know how to like, like get people to find me? Well, remember the first thing that I told you is find people that have strong identities. That's what I would do. Like Beagle is a strong identity, right? We have a Beagle here in Bali. Now I just typed in the word Beagle, and look at this, Beagle gifts, and now you have all of these things that pop up. Now what these are are search terms, meaning there's thousands of people every single month searching for this. If I just put this in my title on MerchByAmazon.com, the odds of them finding me are a lot higher. Does that make sense? So check this out. Let me just do Beagle Gifts for Beagle Lover. The next thing that I wanna do, once I start seeing a design that works, is I wanna scroll down and see if there's a lot of reviews and a lot of competitors with similar designs. You can see on this page it's only 100 reviews, here it's only 61, here it's only three. So here is a keyword where like Amazon's telling me people are searching for it, but there's not that much competitors of t-shirts, and you know, you could see that there's only a couple t-shirts there. That would be a very big idea for me to go ahead and you know rank for that keyword. So I would then do that and see what other things that I could do for it. Let's do cat gifts for cat lovers, that's another thing, right? Check this out, three reviews, 16,000 reviews, 700 reviews, a little bit more, right? But there's less t-shirts, right? C compare this to if I do like cat t-shirts for women, you could see that you know there's a lot more reviews here, so it's a little bit more competitive. So what I would do is click on space and go even more deeper. Uh, cat t-shirt women's for funny, and you could see that the reviews get a lot less when you go find even more specific keywords. Does that make sense? I would make a long list of keywords and all of these designs for as many different you know uh, occupations and jobs and animals and pets because that's what's the strongest for, for example, you know, identity-wise. Now, the moment I did that, all I would do is very simple. If I'm just beginning and I don't have any money whatsoever, right, and I wanna just like do something as simply like easily distracted by cats, or for example, any one of these things, I would go ahead to Pinterest, type in the word cat t-shirt and see something that's like very simple for me to create. Like, look at this. Here's one that I didn't see in, for example, Amazon. I like coffee, my cat, and maybe three other people. I haven't seen that design, maybe this one is kind of like similar, but I don't see that design really on here. What does that mean? Is it gives me an idea where maybe I could go ahead and for example, model it and sell it, right? So I could go to Canva, type in create a design, type in something as simple as like t-shirt, check this out, t-shirt design. I could come in here, create an existing design for me for free, and check this out. I could go ahead and do some of these things. Uh, here's one right here. I just want my cat, coffee, and three other people, right? Here is a design that I literally made within seconds that I could kind of like move this box around, download it, upload it on Merch by Amazon, and then within like minutes, it's already on Amazon, right? So that's just one way, just taking designs that already worked. Now, once you start ranking for things, remember some of these designs can make you $100 a month in passive income. The next thing that you would do is of course, just make more designs. Because how much money you make is strictly by how many designs that you make. Does that make sense? That's why looking for low competitive keywords are the most important. Because if you could find things on the first page for only five reviews, that's huge. I would just put as many designs there as possible. When I would start making money, I would start going to like Upwork, hire a graphic designer for less than $10 an hour below from the Philippines, and now get them to make more of the complicated designs. Like you could see this person makes these designs for the t-shirts and they really help out. Some of these people only charge even like $7 an hour. So it's very, very affordable we'll go ahead and do this, right? So just doing that method alone on Amazon, you could start for free and get started with nothing, right? Where else can you go ahead and do this? You can do the exact same thing on Etsy, right? Etsy is another place where there's like about 422 million visitors that go to this every single month and you could like link it up with Printful for free. Now the beauty about this is now you're not just stuck to t-shirts that you could sell for free. You could also sell things like directly on Etsy because it links for it. And you can sell things like leggings, like t-shirts, like tank tops, like masks, like look at this, joggers, masks, all of these. And the thing is you don't have to buy this until after you've made a sale. So it's the exact same thing on Amazon. If I type in like for example yoga pants cat or cat yoga, look at this, 
See this is a pop up? Again, people are searching for this. So look at this. This cat yoga pants right here is being sold for $45, right? Right here. They have made a thousand sales. Now, the thing about like Printful is it connects with Etsy so that whenever someone buys from Etsy, Printful automatically prints it on their designs, they ship it to the customer, and they charge you, but they only charge you after you've already made the sale. So look at this, leggings are about $20 right here, and they're selling it over here for $45. So that's huge. But what if we look at the other designs? What are they selling? They're also selling masks for $19.95. Well, look at this, the mask here is only for $2.87. So that's like a huge thing. Like take the designs on Printful, throw it up on Etsy, and then make a sale. And when you make a sale, it automatically charges you. But remember, you'll only have to buy it after you've already made a sale. Does that make sense? Now, something that you could do to add fuel to the fire is even doing this for like creators. Like I could even come in here and type in the word cat tips. And if I really wanted to make a bunch of money with t-shirts, I could kind of do this as a service and reach people like, for example, someone like Mia Stone, someone that only has 4,000 subscribers but 700,000 views for, for example, you know, like cat videos. they would be like, hey, I would love to partner with you for a cat business. Let me create a bunch of collections for you on Etsy and on Amazon and we'll split the profits. And you can literally go up to these people, have them do that because they're not making any money. You can help them monetize, but they do most of the outside marketing that's off of Etsy and off of Amazon and they'll help you even rank on Amazon and Etsy because how they work is when you start making a lot of sales, right? Amazon and Etsy will start ranking you higher and higher and higher in their you know, search systems, allowing you to get found even more. So that's another thing you could go ahead and do. And that is how you would go ahead and start a t-shirt business for free and make your first $100 a day profit. But of course, there's faster and easier ways to make money online. I mean, if that's all you care about, making money online, we have people with this brand new opportunity this year that's even faster and easier than what we just talked about. Go from zero to 30 grand a month in five to eight weeks, like stay-at-home mom Dina at age 47 years old. If you wanna know what she did, step by step by step by step, then sign up for this week's free workshop below. Check out this video on this podcast right here. See you guys later. Woo!